All right, what is going? What is happening? How's everybody doing today? My name is Chuck, and welcome back to a brand new video for you guys here today. Is we're we'll gonna be diving straight into some crazy season seven trailers. These are a lot of trailers that have been going around. A lot of people are really anxious to get their hands on season seven, and it's, it is only just a couple short weeks away, and it's just going absolutely crazy. The season seven hype train is at an all-time high. So if you guys are hyped for season seven, make sure you guys smash a like on the video. That'd be fantastic. If you could break a total of fifteen hundred likes on on this video and it really just make my day and if you guys also want to win some free skins from your boy chuck make sure you guys smash like in the video subscribe plus notifications and comment down below and with that being said let's dive in into some of the crazy season seven trailers that we have to take a look at because a lot of these are hinting at what is actually to come here and obviously fortnite season seven i'm super excited for it so let's dive straight into it i want to put out real fast is that i'll leave the links to both of these trailers down in the description below in case any of you guys want to go check any of them out i think they're super awesome and they are definitely worth the watch on your own so yeah with that being said let's dive into this very first trailer here which is obviously a fan-made trailer by somebody that is very dedicated to fortnite and just really wants to be able to make a trailer so props to him so let's dive into this and see exactly who he created it was because what he thinks is going to happen to season seven so let's go all right here we go ladies and gentlemen looks like i got a port of rifts Ooh. This is from the cube, okay. The little llama's just right there watching. <laughs> so it looks like he's setting this up to do with the cube right now. Because the cube played a massive part in the storyline for season six. I can definitely see why he's going with that. The islands, the cube cultivating itself, moving all the islands. This is actually really, really cool. Re well made by this guy. It's very interesting. Oh. The cube finally, finally exploding or coming down to its final form. Cracking open. Oh man, here we go. Yo, this is this is crazy right now. This is kind of intense music, not gonna lie. <laughs> Oh, here we go, okay, okay. The butterfly event. And that looks like to be, oh, setting us up for season seven right there with the parachute. Are you kidding me, man? That was, a, that was a really good trailer, really good. But we got another one to show you guys. All right, so on to the next trailer, boys. This one is actually by, made by somebody who doesn't even speak English. But a very, very well made trailer. Like I said, links to both of these, of course, will be in the description below. So we left off, it seems, with that last time in that first trailer, and now we're starting off with it this time. It's kind of weird how those line up. That's the snowstorm. That's the snowstorm that everybody's been talking about. You guys can see off of Flush Factory. Oh, man. He, he's got to go down. Genji's got to go down to the basement. Oh, looks like my guy's going down to the command center. Something's indeed wrong. Oh, shoot. Sirens like that are never good. Anywhere, in any game, anytime. Real life or war video games, they're never good. Fortnite's in trouble. Season 7, ladies and gentlemen. It's a tornado snowstorm? What? Oh, that's crazy. Oh my god. It's like a, a snow snowstorm tornado thing. Coming straight from the ocean. And then now it's Christmas time, like season seven is supposed to be themed. Is what everybody's saying. I'll have more information on that later in the video. So snow's down. There's the battle bus. Nice. Happy holidays from the Fortnite team, aka Epic Games. And you can see the battle bus above. 
right above the land of Fortnite. So what did you guys think of those couple trailers? I thought those were absolutely fantastic and very, very good, well-made or very well-made fan-made trailers. I'm, 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 I'm saying the same words a lot, but those are very good uh, fan-made trailers. And I wanted to showcase those to you guys here in the video because those were, you know, deciding, those were adding in a lot of key things that I've been talking about in some of my previous videos. And I kind of wanted to go back and discuss some of the stuff that actually happened in that second trailer more so because the first one actually paid a lot more homage to the cube itself. And we've actually talked about the cube a lot. We've actually dug into everything regarding the cube. So there's no real reason for us to go back and talk about it. But one of the main focal points of this whole second trailer, which is just what everybody's been leading it up to being, I'm sure maybe you've seen some of the stuff starting to pop into your sub box about a snow, like a, like a snowstorm event type of thing that's actually going to be happening. And the reason people are talking about a snowstorm event is purely because that there's that massive cloud that was out there in the ocean or whatever that people could actually see off of the coast of Flush Factory. So if you're on PlayStation, Xbox, like Nintendo Switch, a PC, if you guys went over to Flush Factory, at any point in time, you guys can actually look out into the ocean and see a massive sort of cloud. And what people are actually putting that together is what I talked about in one of my previous videos is the fact that, you know, like a snowstorm or like a cloud of that sort of, you know, stature, basically one that is that low to the ground, where a lot of people actually make that up to be is the fact that that is a cloud full of condensation. Obviously, you know, that's what clouds basically are. But if this is going to be turning into a snowstorm, obviously, everybody knows that water does turn, obviously, to ice. So that is actually going to be the snowstorm cloud. And there's no real reason for it to actually be there other than the fact that it is supposed to be a snowstorm. It just, it doesn't make any sort of sense. We've been seeing a lot of stuff in the game's files. If you guys also have taken notice to the fact that the weekly uh, challenge skin, the aim skin, A.I.M, that sort of skin on top of having his back bling, which is the kill counter, which is pretty freaking awesome if I do say so myself, on top of him having, you know, frost on his feet. If you guys have seen any of those images, obviously I'll be flashing stuff up on screen so you guys can, you know, see exactly what I'm talking about. But, you know, he's got frost on his feet. We got a snowstorm cloud out there in the distance and also on top of the fact that season seven does start on December 12th. So when December 12th, obviously that's going to be Christmas time for everybody. Myself, personally, I just had to put a car away for the winter. So, I mean, obviously, you know, there's going to be snow coming down here at least in the next few days for me. So with that being said, I mean, that's just kind of exactly what people are thinking just because, you know, we have so much stuff regarding leading us up to, you know, a snow time, obviously just within, you know, the time period of the year. Epic Games always likes to take advantage of actual current, you know, real life events, much like they did for Halloween. So I do not think that's, you know, uncharacteristic of them to actually take us into a full blown snow type of event or a snow type of season. And with actually having a snow type of season with, you know, the aim skin leading us up to that, the whole snowstorm, you know, that's out in the distance that I think maybe has since been removed. And also, if you guys have noticed at some points, when you guys fly in over the Viking village, one of the unnamed points in the map, there has been little flurries and stuff that actually have gone around in the sky. So that's kind of one of those things right there that we've had a snow point of interest on the map. So we have a lot of stuff leading us up to that. So we should be seeing a lot of snow related stuff heading or Christmas related stuff heading into the battle pass season seven, just basically everything like that. And on top of all this stuff I've been talking about here within the video and what you guys have been seeing in the trailer is that, you know, just to kind of top it all off, obviously, you know, it is going to be Christmas time. Christmas is, you know, the season of giving, spending time with your friends, your family, just the, the people that you care about and then, you know, vice versa that care about you. And so with that being said, you know, when you actually do that, that's actually also the season of giving or, or you know, like to call it a season of gifting, <laughs> you know, you know, hint, hint, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. That is what a lot of people are saying is going to be coming here within season seven as well is the gifting system just purely because it actually falls around with the right time of year. It has been in the game's files for such, such a long time. I mean, it has been absolutely ridiculous. We've had the ability to actually receive gifts from other people's, probably basically since like season five, maybe even the last little bit of season four. So we're coming up on two full seasons that we've been waiting for this thing to actually come to the game. So we have so much stuff leading us up to getting a snow released season or snow type of theme season that there's basically nothing else that Epic Games can really do to kind of throw us off of that and so that's why I wanted to show you guys these fan made trailers I thought it was super awesome and I think a lot of this information has actually been portrayed into that but I wanted to kind of you know elaborate a little bit afterwards to show you guys you know what I'm talking about and what is all the stuff you guys should generally be caught up on in terms of you know what's going to be happening with this next season so that all being said my name has been Chuck hope you guys did happen to have enjoyed today's video if you guys did make sure you guys smash the thumbs up on a subscribe bless your notifications and comment down below and that's really all I got to say so I I shall hopefully see you guys all here around in the future on a video, but until next time, just run on Triple Cap, don't be Randy, and I'm out.
Peace.